are live. Hello. You're now live. Hi, guys. <sighs> Hello. Hello. Um, Hi guys, just a moment. Meet okay. with you in a second. There we are. There we are. Can you get niche? Can you guys mic it? There we are. Got it? Nice. Nice, nice, nice. You are. <clears throat> oh, gang, oh, Gucci, Gucci, gang. Hey guys, uh, be with you in a minute. We're going to start in a minute. In a minute. In a one That's minute. One minute. An exact minute. 60 seconds. One minute. Um, which is... Yeah. <laughs> All right. Okay, guys. Hello. Uh, I'm Stephen. I'm React. And welcome to our live lesson, the nostra lezione gratuita, che facciamo ogni giovedì. Today we are talking about something really fun, really interesting. And it is happy hour. Happy hour. Guys. The best hour. <laughs> In this lesson, we've got quantifiers, drinks, and recipes. Good. Recipes, not receipts. Recipes. Excellent. Very good. Not receipts, guys. Recipes. Quantifiers, cosa vuol dire in inglese? For example, some, many, much, any. Questo tipo di parola si chiama quantifiers, ok? Ooh, ok. So. What we got? Mm. Ok. Drinks. Discuss the questions. Mm. I love drinks. <laughs> do you? I do. <laughs> Steven, yeah. question for you. Uh -huh. Number one. What is your favorite drink? My favorite drink is a Bloody Mary. Bloody Mary. Guys, Bloody Mary. What is a Bloody Mary? Uh, it, Bloody Mary is a cocktail, a okay. mixed drink with vodka, tomato juice, and Tabasco. Mm. Interesting. Okay. Very, interesting. Very strange. Yeah. <laughs> and um, you guys, what's your favorite drink? What do you guys drink? Hmm? Like? Rian, yeah. um, how often do you drink alcohol? Um, I drink alcohol mm -hmm. every Friday mm -hmm. with my friends. Cool. Only every Friday? And every Saturday. <laughs> you guys, yeah. how often do you drink alcohol? Do you like to drink? Do you not drink alcohol? It's okay. Let us know right in the chat. Yeah. And, um... I have another one for you, Stephen. Oh, thank you, eh? <laughs> Number three. Mm -hmm. Do you go for drinks often? With your family or friends? Hmm. Good question. Mm -hmm. um, I don't go uh, drinking with my friends or family very often. No. Do you? Uh, yes. I go for drinks with my friends mm -hmm. twice a week. Okay. Yeah. You 
you guys? You. When you go drinking alcohol, when we say drinking. It means uh, drinking alcohol. Yeah, often or not so often? Let us know. Uh, Rian, okay, I have a question for you. Mm. What do you think happy hour means? Um, it's an hour where people are happy during really? the day. Really? Yeah. Are you sure? Yeah. Hmm. What does it mean, Stephen? I don't think that a happy hour is a special time of the day mm -hmm. where all bars or pubs in the UK uh, sell drinks very cheap. Okay? Ah. For a cheaper price. Okay? Happy hour. Yes. Because it's cheap. Yes. It makes sense. Exactly. Right? I get it. So, yeah, happy hour. Uh, so today, we're going to talk about vocabulary we can use for happy hour. I love happy hour. <laughs> right. So, yeah. Mm -hmm. I fancy, mm -hmm. I want, match the words to, the, to make the correct names of the drinks. Mm -hmm. So, we've got number one, hot, number two, flavoured, Green, apple, ginger, bloody, cloudy, and non-alcoholic. Excellent. And here we have tea, cider, chocolate, water, merry, lemonade, cocktail, and beer. Okay? So we want you guys to match the words on the left with the words on the right. For example, what is number one, Rian? Number one is hot chocolate. Yes, exactly. Mm. Hot chocolate. So guys, please try to match number two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight with the right word. Go, right in the chat. We'll give you some time. Okay. So two, mm, three, mm, four, five, Right in the chat for us. I can't see the messages that came up on the chat. Where go? Are the group clicking? I'm lost. I don't know. I don't know. Yeah, it's there. Yeah, it's not. Yes, there we go. Hi, Claudia! Hi, Claudia! The words, the left, the right, or the left. Excellent, Talia. Fantastic. Nicely Good. done. Check out Instagram, Stephen. Mm -hmm. Lovely, Ma Marco. Marco is always here. Well done. Well done, Marco. Ooh, I'm surprised. Yeah. Keep going. Keep going. Twenty more seconds, okay? Right. Oh my God. Okay. So, oh sorry, twenty more seconds. Twenty. <laughs> We like to. Yeah. It's a difficult one. Good, Francesca. Mm -hmm. Go, good. Nice, Nicole. Well done. All right. Yeah, that's it. Ten, nine, nine eight, eight, seven, seven six, six, five, four, four three, three, two, two one. one. Excellent. Claudia, yes. But there's also another option for oh. the one you just said. Yeah. Didn't think about that, did we? She's right. It's very right. nice, Claudia. Yeah. You got us. <laughs> you outsmarted us. So number two <laughs> is flavored water. What is that? What is flavored water? So here in Italy, non c'è, di solito non c'è, ma in Inghilterra, in Stati Uniti, we have drink, we have water with strawberry, con fragole, no? Oh. Sapore di fragole. Wow. Or water with lemon. Già limonata, non è dolce, ma c'è un sapore di, di limone. So we call this flavored water. Number three, we have? Uh, green tea. Mm -hmm. Everybody was correct, well done. Yes, exactly. Number four, we have apple cider. Cidro, lo sapete questo? I love apple yeah. cider. Number five? Ginger beer. Okay, what is ginger beer? Ginger beer. Don't ask me, I have never tried it. Ginger beer, guys, is not beer, it's non-alcoholic. It's only the name, ginger beer. 
It's very sweet, like a soda. So it's like root beer, if you know it. And what's ginger? Ginger, ginger is um, a vegetable. Zentero! <laughs> yeah, Zentero. <laughs> yeah, yes, so Zentero. Okay. And yeah. Good. And next we have Bloody Mary. I've already told you guys, my favorite drink. And then we have. Cloudy lemonade. What is that, Rihanna? What is cloudy lemonade? Okay, so. Cloudy lemonade mm -hmm. would be limonata, mm. and something like Sprite mm. would be only lemonade. Ah. So cloudy lemonade looks a bit thick. Right. Right, 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 right. So, okay. 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 Perfect. The last one. Mm -hmm. so we have a non. But you're right, Claudia. Non-alcoholic beer exists, but we meant uh, non non non-alcoholic. <laughs> Cocktail. So a cocktail sends alcohol. Okay. Okay. So any kind of cocktail without alcohol. Very good, guys. So now, nice. We have some questions here. Um, Rian, mm -hmm. have you tried all of these drinks? Uh, ooh, no, I haven't no? tried all of these drinks. Which ones haven't you tried? I haven't tried ginger beer. Okay. And I haven't tried Bloody Mary. Okay, okay. And you guys, which ones haven't you tried? I haven't tried. Yeah. Steven, you, have you tried all of these drinks? Yes, I have. I have tried all of these drinks. And yeah. so, which is your favorite? Mm. Why? My favorite is a Bloody Mary. Okay. Because it is healthy and fun. <laughs> it has vitamins from the tomato juice and it has alcohol for fun. Good! I like that! <laughs> nice combination! Yeah, it's great. Very nice. And uh, then you, Rian, of yeah. the ones you tried, which one is your least favorite and why? My least yeah, favorite? Least, least favorite. Okay, 10, 9, 
two guys is a flask. Mm -hmm. okay. a flask. Flask. Very nice. Uh, number three is Carter. Number four is, your question, Kada, is a can. Okay. Yeah, like Nicole said, is a, is a can. Latina. Kada, it's not flash, it's flask. Con capa, with a K. Very nice. Uh, number five is a glass. Mm -hmm. And number six is a bottle. Okay. Very good. Very nice. Well done. Awesome. Good job, guys. Perfect. And now... Let's try to do this activity. Okay, so can you think of a drink that is served in each container? For example, tea is served in a mug, a cup of tea. So in the chat, write the drink. Hoy is served in a and choose the correct container. Yes. Okay. Yes, Claudia, flask is like a ther thermos. Yeah. Yes. There's a thermos is a brand of a of flask. So yeah. Mm -hmm. Right. Um, so yes. So for example, did you give an example? For no. Yeah. Okay. So for example, hot chocolate is served in a mug. Okay. So guys, try to write an example. Uh, is served in a uh. Okay. Uh, we another example possibly to help our students. Ooh, let's do hmm. Coca Cola mm -hmm. is served in a can. Yeah. Not a cup. What's that? <laughs> this is a cup. It's a cup. <laughs> Stephen, has started happy hour. Yeah. A bit of beer, guys. What you got there then? Beer? Got some beer. Yeah. Ginger beer? No, real beer. Nice. Beer beer. Some alcohol in there. Yeah. <laughs> I'm, gonna have, I'm gonna have some fun with you guys. Oh, what's this? Ooh, Ooh. Teacher Ria is a... Coca-Cola? Is Not in a bottle. <laughs> in a glass bottle. <laughs> Paint promotion. Excellent, got a Coke in a can. Water in a glass. Good. Cloudy, not con, not with, yeah. but in, in a can. Marco, yes. Uh, coffee is served in a mug, yes. In the US, it is served in a mug. Good one, Marco. Great grammar, Nicole. Francesco says wine is served in a glass. Yes, very good, Francesco. Wine is served in a glass. Laura uh -huh. says soup. Now you guys, oh sorry, 
Yes, we do. There's loads oh. of cold cans in the fridge behind you. Loads, tanto. Loads, okay? And you guys do number two, three, four, five. Number two. Excuse me, can I get mm, more ice in my glass, please? Ah, what's ice, Stephen? Ice. Ice, gacho. Ah, okay. Very nice. Uh, number three, mm -hmm. I'm worried about service. Mm -hmm. We don't have mm, glasses for happy hour. Yeah, that's the answer there. Uh -oh. Number four, I love this bar. It's cheap and has mm, of drink choices. Mm, of drink cheap. choices. Yeah. If it's cheap, it's great. Yeah. And number five, would you mind putting mm, more coffee into my flask? Mm, yeah. More coffee. Alright. We're going to give you about 20 seconds, mm -hmm. okay? Because it's a little bit difficult. It's a challenge, yes. this one. Nice, Nicole. Good. Keep going. Let's check out our answer. Very nice. Oh, Christina, very nice, Christina. Mm -hmm. Number three, yes, you got it. Really good. That you got. <gasps> That's it. Keep going, guys. Keep going, guys. Well done, guys.
for my team. So what are sachets, guys? Sachets, okay? If you can see that. Ah, Sachet. Little packet, though. I don't know what it's on there. Yeah, a little pack. Of sugar for my tea. Okay. I need you. Very nice. Right. Um, number four. We serve mm, types of cider in this bar. Would you like to try? Yeah. Mm -hmm. So, 
qua bisogna mettere la parola giusto con il giusto significato. Ok? For example, let's try the yeah, first okay. one. Number uh, one, cut. Incision or division with a sharp tool. Go guys, try number two, three, four, and five. Yeah, right in the chat box. Remember one, mm, two, mm, three, yeah. mm, okay. Keep going, Patrick. Well done, very nice. Very nice. Oh, hi, Tommaso. Welcome. Hello, Tommaso. Keep going, guys. Bye. Let's just control and check those. Um, yeah. Yeah. It looks like Siev, chicken Kiev. 
Kiev, yeah. but it is not. It is Siv. Yeah. Siv. Exactly. Okay. Siv. Yeah. So we're going to give you again, guys, about 20 seconds. Remember, mm. two equals mm, three equals mm, right in the chat for us, okay?
three tables, guys. Really nice. Excellent. Really, really good. Good. Gabi Legazzi, well done. Good job. Good job. Oof. Wow. So, now we have a challenge for you guys. Very big challenge. Very difficult, okay. Uh, here we have some sentences, mm -hmm. some phrases okay. um, that, okay, let's read this. First, okay, you guys, you need to decide who's speaking, the customer or the waiter, right? So we have sentences, che dice cliente e che dice cameriere, okay? okay. Voi dovete decidere se questa frase, chi dice, mm. di solito, cliente o cameriere, right? Okay. So who says these sentences? So if, if you can't see them, we'll read it for you. Um, I'll go first one. Of course, and welcome to happy hour. Chi dice questo, cameriere o cliente? Remember, right? Number one, waiter or customer. Mm -hmm. Okay, watch out. Number two, yup, here's your table. Mm. Here is your table. Yeah. Number three, sure, what would you like? What would you like? Number four, mm. yes, please. Che dice questo? Cliente o cameriere? Number five, go on then. Can I get a basket of fries too? What do you love a basket of fries? <laughs> Crispy <laughs> chips with beer. Crispy <laughs> chips. <laughs> Number six. Yeah. It's happy hour. Great. Yeah. Chi dice questo? Number seven. No problem. Would you like that with a fresh slice of orange? Mm. Fresh slice of orange. Mm -hmm. Number eight. Hi there. Could I get a table for two? Mm -hmm. My friend will join me in a bit. Mm -hmm. Great. And next one. Thanks. Could I get a drink while I'm waiting? Chi dice questo? Cameriere o cliente? Number nine, thanks. Could I get a drink while I'm waiting? Right? 
right? So obviously it's an order and an order, right? So this is the customer uh, again. Yeah. While I'm waiting, what happens ah, while I'm waiting? Good question. While I'm waiting, a mentre sto aspettando, right? While I'm waiting. Oh, okay, okay. So in attesa. Mm. Yeah. And number 10, I will have an orange juice, please. Mm. Has to be the customer. They said, please. Any ice? No, oh, actually, this is the waiter. the waiter. Obviously, the waiter asking the customer, Do you want any ice? In your orange juice. Right. And number 12. Of course, I'll bring them over when they are ready. Excellent. The waiter. Right. Great, guys. Yeah. Actually, really, really good, by the way. Fantastic. I Very don't think there's any mistake. So now, okay, we have uh, a few more conversation questions okay, okay. to use the vocabulary and the quantifiers uh, from today. Mm -hmm. These are last uh, questions for today. So Rian, yep. um, a question for you. Can I ask you something? What types of snacks do you think people order during happy hour? Ooh, uh, okay, so in the UK, mm -hmm. in, in Wales, in England, mm -hmm. um, during happy hour, we order chips, patatina frite, yeah. chips, um, and chicken wings. Mm. Yeah. That's right. In the US, we order chicken wings. Oh, as well. Similar. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Um, how about in Italy? What snacks do, do people order during an aperitivo, during yeah. happy hour? Let us know, write in the chat. What do you guys usually order? Because uh, I'll spend the boy in a happy hour, but people go in Italian. Hmm. Okay. Number three, um, what, not snacks, but what drinks, Rian? What drinks mm -hmm. do people order for an aperitivo in Italy? Like, what do you order in an aperitivo? Um, I like to order a Moscow mule Oof. <laughs> for an aperitivo. Very strong. In Italy, because they, they make, you guys make really good Moscow mules. Mm. Uh, how about you, Stephen? What do you like to order in Italy? Good question. I usually order spritz. Ah, of Very course. simple, just a spritz. Good. Yeah. Ah, so in Italy, we've got people saying olives. Patatine nuts. Excellent. Very nice. Patatine crisps. Great. Crisps in a packet. Great. Crisps. Yeah, nice. um, ah, yeah, Stephen. What time do people usually go for an aperitivo in Italy? Hmm, do you know? I don't know? I'm not sure, guys. Let us know. Do you know what time usually is aperitivo here? In, what's happy hour here in uh, okay. Florence, in Italy, in general? Do you guys know? Seven, eight, eight, eight. Ah, Claudia says pizzette tartine. Yeah. What is that? Ah, those little, yeah, those little pizza. Yeah, you can buy them frozen in the supermarket right. too. Little, little, what do we call those? Little mini pizza. Mini, mini pizza. Yeah. <laughs> mini pizza. Yeah, right. Yeah, that's right, Claudia. We have little mini pizzas as well. And they have different, um, different things inside. Yeah, 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 yeah. Those are good. So like we would those. have sausage rolls. Right. We would have sausage rolls. Sausage yes. yeah. Uh, very nice. nice. Making me hungry. So, what time? What time is a typical aperitivo yeah. in Italy or the happy hour? What time Marco is says in the aperitivo they have pasta. Yes. Ah, you guys yes, have lots of pasta and uh, couscous. Yes. I'm just yeah. thinking of kitchen. Now. Heavy. You guys have big heavy meals. For yeah. Right. Very nice. And last question for today, guys. Mm -hmm. Um. What time do you, we know, but what time do you think happy hour um, usually is in the UK? So what time is happy hour in the UK? What do you think? Hmm. What do you think, guys? Stroke the beard, yeah. twist the moustache, scratch the head. So, Rian? We've got the, uh, yeah. Can we help them? What is happy hour, when, when is happy hour in the UK? Happy hour can actually 
actually be extended to about two hours or half the hour, usually from about four till about six p.m. Uh, wow. Nice and early. Four. Most people finish work about five and yeah. head straight to the pub. Ooh. And at university, happy hour is all day, pretty much. Wow. <laughs> it's great. I don't know in Italy. Um, exactly. Somebody let us know. Yeah. The exact hour in America. The same. Yeah. Usually it's before dinner, so it's five or six. Five or six as well. Yeah. Maybe even six to seven. Yeah. yeah. It depends actually. Yeah. Pretty nice. Excellent. Bravi ragazzi. Very good. Very good. So before we finish today, yeah. we just have. Uh, Oof, a lot more stuff. Uh, we have a more few questions. things, some fun questions for you guys, okay. very interesting, funny questions. Um, but first, uh, we have to explain what these things are. Okay, um, Rian, are you a slurper? And what is a slurper? So a slurper is somebody who drinks, um. making this sound. Are you a slurper? I am not a slurper. I am a slurper. Oh no, <laughs> are you? Ah, oh, slurper over here. What the fuck is he? <laughs> That's terrible. So, Stephen, how do you feel about slurpers? I support them. Slurp. Slurp away. Slurp away. <laughs> Guys, let us know, are you a slurper? We've got. And Ian, I have a question for you. I don't know what this means. Okay. Are you a hot drink sipper ah. or a hot drink downer? What is a sipper so, and what so is a downer? Think okay. about the queen. Huh. She has a cup of tea and she sips her cup of tea. Mm. <laughs> ah. ah, like with, with, with a coffee or tea. Yeah, just a little. All right, all right. And stop. Okay. Now a downer, is on the other hand, yeah. is somebody who go 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 gone, ah, all in right. one. Right. They finish the drink in a second. Like Homer Simpson. Homer oh. Simpson. Right. Finished. Okay. So are you a hot drink sipper or a hot drink downer? I do believe I am a hot drink sipper. Hmm. Yes. Okay. Are you Stephen? Um, I'm brave. I'm a hot drink downer. No. I, hot chocolate, I just gulp it down. I don't care. Does it burn? It does, but it feels great. <laughs> you guys, are you a hot drink sipper or a hot drink downer? Ah, in Italian. Thank you, Claudia. Slurping is sorseggiare. Ah, there is a word. We didn't know. Thank you, Claudia. Ah, nice. Are you a slurper? Are you a slurper or a sipper, Claudia? Uh, Stephen, have you ever been to a wine sampling event before? Sampling? Sample, so, for example, yeah. you have five different types of wine. Okay. And you sip each wine just to try. Uh, yeah. This is okay. A little bit of everything. Exactly. Okay, okay. Huh. Yes, then I've been to a wine sampling event. In Tuscany, yes. there's a lot, right? Yeah, yeah, yeah. it's great. Mm -hmm. It's great, it's great. Have you guys been to a wine sampling event uh, in, in Tuscany? And where? Yeah, in Tuscany or somewhere else? Let us know. And last year, yep. I don't know if this new word for us again. Do you ever make a gulping sound when drinking? A gulping sound? Um, do you what know? What is a gulping sound? So, a gulping sound is this. Not, 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 not this sound. Ah, look, 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 right. <laughs> so, huh. do you ever make a look, look, gulping sound when drinking? I mean, I don't think so. Yeah. But maybe after running, I take a bottle of water and I gulp it <laughs> before I die. <laughs> and one bit of exercise. Great. Uh, Stephen, are you? A gulper? Do you make a gulping sound? Yes, I do. Yes. I do gulp. Why? Gulp. It's fun. It's fun. It's fun. It's fun to drink. Mm. 